Hi, welcome back to Fake It To Make It, or hello if you're new. Today I am decorating my monthly spread um, for October in my classic planner. This is my catch-all. I do have some little sticky notes here to remind myself of some soccer tournaments. Um, so I'm just going to remove those. Oops, there we go. And get started. And of course, for October, I have to use this Halloween book, sticker book, um, by the Happy Planner. It came out with the latest release. You can only get it on thehappyplanner.com. I believe it it was sold out. I don't know if it still is, but I will leave a link down below and you can go check it out. So let's get started. I know I want to put like a happy Halloween. I've pulled a few stickers already, so I know I want something up here. So I'm just going to white these lines out. This is my Union Ball Signo Whiteout Pen. It works so good. I love this more than the gel pen. Um, I will also link this down below. So these are a few of the stickers I pulled just because I was sitting here for quite a while kind of picking through, trying to decide. Um, I also have some spiderweb washi from White Stag Art that I'm probably going to incorporate as well. And I think because I'm going to put the um, spooky or let's get spooky, I think it says up here, and the lettering is black, I think I'm gonna use this white. Um, yeah, I think I'm gonna use this white washi up here. This is so cute. Perfect. You still be able to see the letters. Yes. Okay, perfect. And then I have a little witch's cauldron here. I think I'm going to do a little bit of this washi across the top here. Just kind of lay that that way. Um, let's see. Let's do a little black washi down here in the corner. This is really cute. It has like little spiders in it. I'm in desperate need to get my nails done. My nails, I mean, they, the polish itself looks really good. It's just grown out quite a bit. Just have not had time. All right, where's my card at? Let's see. Good. And I have this. Little sticker here. I am seriously obsessed with the colors in this sticker book this year. I think it is seriously perfection. I think I want a little bit of this under here as well. No, Get a little bit more. Shoot. I think I will be using this sticker book all month because I'm literally obsessed with it. Okay, next I'm going to put this on my birthday. 
which is the 21st. Um, and then my daughter has, so I'm trying to mark things off. So on Halloween, we do have on the 24th and on Halloween, we have Oh, I didn't really wanna, I wanna cover that up, but I'd rather cover up this. I think we'll do it this way. We have soccer games. Oops. On both these days. So there is that. Let's see what else. She has a game this day on the 22nd. And then she also has one on the 23rd. on this one Actually, I don't think I'm going to do it that way put the stars in the back corner and then what other days she has one on the third um, so I think I'm going to put that boo there, and I think I'm going to use a little of this black washi. Straighten that out. Boo. And then when is the other... Let's see, the 3rd, the 17th, the 22nd, the 24th, the 30th, 30th. That's what I'm missing. Let's do a little black in this corner, too, just to even it out. So we have a lot of black. In the upper corner. October is a busy month. with soccer games. Mm, I don't think I want that going all the way over there. I think I might use some stamps on this spread too. Might use stamps in a little bit. I'm just going to throw this little gravestone here. Let's see what else I want to use from this book. Okay, so those are the big things. <clears throat> I also have a vacation this week. I was thinking about maybe throwing some washi down. But honestly, I, I don't know. That might be a little too much. Let's see. I want take a little bat here. I think I'm going to stamp over here, maybe. I'll leave that one. Let's see if I do this kind of that way. Then I'll have to come back and space out the O. So 
there's only one O. I like it. And I don't know what stamps these are. I don't know if these are Mambi stamps or not, honestly. The font on it sort of looks like that, but I do not recall. I'm just going to add a little. And maybe um, like Hocus Pocus, since I have, I feel like I have a little bit of a witchy theme. So, Actually, I'm almost positive this is a Happy Planner stamp because it's punched. I just now realized that. I thought I recognized the font of the days of the week. So that is an, an oldie but a goodie. Um, let's see. I'm just going to draw a little spider web. In the corner. And maybe a fat little, fat little spider too. Kind of connect him. There we go. And then just some little doodles, you know, that sort of remind me of some smoke or something like that anyway. That is cute, a little doodling. And then I'm going to see if I can find my stamper to distress this. I'm going to spray a little bit of this alcohol, like distress alcohol spray, without making a mess. I don't know how that's gonna work. really want it. Oh man, I just got my hand in this. I am making a huge mess, folks. I like it. All right. And then let's come over here. And I need something to cover up that corner because I don't, <laughs> maybe we can kind of, I just don't want it to cover up that sticker. Let's see, can this come up a little bit? And then that can kind of go there, okay. I think that's good. 
Because I still want to be able to see the month. Oh my gosh, what a mess. Okay. <laughs> I like it. I have to go wash my hands, though. This is the issue of working with ink. Okay. I really like this look, and I wouldn't mind having it like on the spine or somewhere else. Hmm. Where is my dabber? Let's see here. Definitely put the cap on that. That was this um, black marble ink spray. So I like that, but now I feel like I want a little pink. I do have this Amy Tangerine watercolor set. I feel like I need to move stuff and probably dispose of this before I knock it over on the carpet and make a huge mess. Because you know that's what would have happened. All right, we are done, I think think with the stickers. Let me set that over here. Get this open. And there is this really pretty hot pink, but I do need to test it. Okay, let's test this out. Oh, yeah. to wipe this desk off. I should have, um, I don't know, this was not the plan. It just kind of evolved. So I'm gonna have to wipe my desk off a little bit. That's okay though, because I kind of like where this is going. I don't want any drops that are too fat. All right. I think that is good. All right, so this is where we are now. Do I want to add anything else? I feel like maybe we need something over here. What do you think? I feel like there's just, we have a lot going on over here. But now I feel like we need something over here. Hmm. Let's see, is there, oh, I think there was like some witch hats and stuff in here, wasn't there? Yes. Okay. <clears throat> Excuse me. Let's do like one of these cute little, oh, right up here by my little hocus pocus. Yeah, let's do that. And then we have I just need to be careful because I know these pink droplets are not really dry. Um, do we want, so I have a cat, I have a spell book. What are we thinking? Hmm. Let me grab a spell book and see. The, oh shoot let me wipe this line out ah uh, oh my gosh this sticker is really sticking okay as long as I don't smear any of this paint I just flan all over is it going to cover up the Okay. Okay. 
There we go. And then maybe the cat right here. Okay. I like it. And there is a little broom too. And some stars, which are kind of cute. We'll throw those over here by the cauldron. Maybe some over here, too. And I have this broom. I think maybe right here. Oh shoot. Oh. I didn't mean for it to go so far down, but I don't want to, if I pull it up, I'm afraid I'm going to pull up the white out. Okay. I like it. It's really busy, but I'm sort of in love with this spread. How extra can we make it? Let's see. What other stickers? I think there was that pink page. Oh, it has those stars. That is really cute. Is there more? Here. I think this is what I want. Oh, that's really big. Can you see the... Oh. Oh, I like that. Cute. This is like seriously the most extra spread <laughs> I've done in a really long time. Um, I think I might cut this in half. I don't know, do we need anything else on this side? Okay. All right, I think I'm gonna throw on a couple little bats. And then I think we're going to call it a spread because this has gotten very extra. But I also really love it. Okay. I think we will call that a spread, you guys. So this is my October Halloween inspired spread. All the stickers are from this Halloween book from the Happy Planner. The washi was from White Stag. You can still get that, I believe. Um, yeah, so let me know down below what you think. Are you a Halloween lover or not? Um, let me know what you think of the spread 
I know it's a lot. I, I really like how it turned out. I think it's really fun and different, and I love the use of the watercolor and my ink spray. So if you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up, consider subscribing, and I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.